Bing, bong, bing, There's bing, a dog bong, whining. Bong, bing, bing, bong. I'm doing the intro song, so you need to go get him. <laughs> bing, bong, Welcome to Cheese, a Healthy Fruit, a podcast where two sisters reminisce on growing up in rural Wisconsin. I'm Sidel. And I'm Jade. Welcome to another episode. Another one. I'm (laughs) another one. (laughs) Girl, you look ratchet as fuck. Just kidding. I do go down on my future wife. DJ Khaled isn't man enough. All right. Can I tell you what Alex and I have been watching? Yeah. Okay, Alex and I have been watching RuPaul's Drag Race. Oh, um, yes. And we started at the earliest season that's available on Hulu, which right Did now you? is season four, mm. which isn't that bad. Yeah. One, two, and three, the video quality, Oh. not good. I think we started with season five or something when it was we on did Because Prime. we're watching season five right now. <laughs> And I'm like, oh, I know that girl's going home. <laughs> and I'm like, wait, I know that girl's going home because I've seen this before. <laughs> uh, so, like, I'm, like, giving shit away without, yeah. like, intentionally giving shit away. I yeah. just feel like I have the best, like, ESP. You know, I'm like, <laughs> ooh, I can feel what's happening in, like, you know, 2013 when this was recorded. <laughs> I'm, I'm listening to That Spooky and uh, 2020 of mm-hmm. That Spooky. Actually, no, they're into 2021. But, like, the Sorry. baby part of 2021? Yeah, it's yeah. January. And so they're watching Drag Race, of course. Mm-hmm. They do that. They watch Drag Race, and they give their um their highs and lows. So they're talking about, like, Got Mick and stuff. Mm-hmm. And and I was like, oh, yeah, I remember that. You know, like, because I, I didn't actually watch Drag Race because I've never watched Drag Race as it came out. Mm-hmm. Ever. Yeah. So I haven't seen I haven't seen that episode yet even. But okay. Actually, no, there was one time that I was at Zach's and it was on Hulu, mm-hmm. Drag Race, All mm-hmm. Stars. Yes. And I mm-hmm. watched a couple of episodes of it. Yeah. While uh drinking coconut water out of a coconut <laughs> and <laughs> eating the coconut. It was I was living. It was immaculate. You were just like, yes. And he was not for it. No. He didn't really enjoy it. He's like, like, these these people are stupid. (laughs) That's kind of the point, Zach. (laughs) But anyway. They're supposed to be campy as fuck and, like, way too over the top. Yeah, it's true. They are drag queens. Yeah. (laughs) What do you expect? (laughs) But I remember Nikki Tutorials did a collab with Got Mick, and I watched that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, I did that. I did. I watched that, too. Yes. (laughs) Should I get started? Yeah. Okay, so I chose a really, really short topic. You are not Good. allowed to read my thing. Don't read mine. Okay. I, mine is, I tried to keep mine short too. Okay, well, we'll see how that goes because we are really good at tangents. Um, yes, we So are. I would like, I need to make a point, okay? I limited I myself to, to one page. Can I talk? Yep. Okay. <laughs> I just would like to clear the air and let everyone know that Sadell is the literal worst place, okay. person to play video games with. Fuck you. <laughs> It's true. No, you are laughing now because okay, it's fucking Okay, actually, okay, true. here's the thing. Here's the thing. Actually, fuck yes. So <laughs> here's the thing. We are going to make a Patreon at some point. Mm-hmm. And let us know. Email us. <laughs> yeah, send us an email. It's at it did, she's a healthy fruit. Yes, it doesn't have an exclamation gmail.com. point because you can't have exclamation no, points. You can't, if yeah. you're having troubles with that, <clears throat> that's there's no exclamation point. 
Mm-hmm. But it's just she's a healthy fruit. At gmail.com. At gmail.com. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, let us know if this is something that you want to see on Patreon. Us playing video games together. I really think we should figure out but, how to play our 2010 Mario, are we Super yeah Mario bros yeah yeah i think i i the capture card that we got was not good so i think yeah. that we need to f- like i need to do more research and find one that's good mm-hmm. um i did there was one guy who said like he 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 was talking about a capture card because i was looking at capture cards um because mm-hmm. we have one at at church mm-hmm. that i was trying to get to work so he was he was talking about his capture card he's like i really like this one so maybe i should watch that video again and see what the brand was yeah and he said and it works with retro consoles too so Ooh, yeah we have a retro console yeah yeah but sadel is the actual worst person to play video games with so like any gen if... z slash millennial sibling pair wait we played a lot of video games. I have something to say first. I hate you, yes. If you have... I'm already heated. If <laughs> you have capture card recommendations, also email us. Yes. Okay. Sadelle likes having that kind of information. Yeah, I think... She likes having those connections. Well, yeah, and I, I need to know information so I can get stuff that's good, because I tend to not do enough research and then get stuff that's bad. Yeah. So... And then you waste money on it. Yeah. But, so anyway, what were you saying? <clears throat> like any Gen Z slash millennial sibling pairing, we're both like kind of in that like middle area. You're definitely Gen you're, Z. You're an older Gen... Well, okay, so Gen Z started in 96. So you're an older Gen Z and I'm kind of an older or mid Gen yes. Z. Because it's only 15 years. Mm-hmm. It, typically a generation is mm-hmm. so it can fluctuate but the but last also, two are 15 so i think just go with 15 i'm also at like the beginning part you know yes like i have friends who are millennials yes correct so you are I an older of, gen z i have a like, lot of older influence. millennials are kind of like gen x <laughs> i hate you okay so <laughs> we've played a lot of video games um and the reason why i thought of this was because my absolutely lovely beautiful talented amazing fiance alex Uh she just got me a present Mm -hmm. which was switch sports switch sports with extra like the tools for like the different games so there's like we have tennis rackets that you can put the like console um, joy con in shit yeah we can put the controllers in i love it so much it's so extra yeah is it just tennis rackets what other things there's are there? tennis rackets there's um they have the leg bands for the soccer one <laughs> they have which wait the, what there's soccer wait, so wait you put a leg you band put on, things your, on leg your leg oh and you kick so so when you play soccer the the switch controller goes on your foot on your leg okay yeah and that makes sense. Because you don't play soccer with your hands. Yeah, you could play, like, baseball, but that would be weird. Yeah. But <laughs> then they have, like, they have that, like, you know, we were talking about that sword thing that I don't remember what uh-huh. that is. Yes. Yeah, they have the little swords. Wow. Can, yeah. Nice. It's cute. It's really cute. Um, seems That one seems a little bit dangerous. Yeah, I don't think you're supposed to hit each other with them. Yeah, you are supposed to face the, the TV, you know? Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's how we did tennis. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Anywho. Um, so maybe the tennis mm-hmm. rackets are more dangerous. Could possibly be because they are also the longest thing that came in that box. Yeah, and you guys are, you're, you're swinging, you know. Yeah. Like, so. It's like the way The way that you, yeah, sideways and the yeah. person standing next to you. The way that you would do if you wanted to slap someone in the back of the head. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you were <laughs> intending to, yes. I think I was going to say something, but I don't remember what it is now. Oh, yeah, we only, the only, like, plastic game pieces that we had for our Wii was the gun. Yeah, we got a hunting game. Yeah. With the gun. <laughs> yeah, we, like, we bought it at Gander it. Mountain. Gander Mountain, may she rest in Great. peace. Great. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but I keep calling Switch Sports Wii Sports because my brain is just like, oh, fuck yeah. It's like, Wii Sports. It's Wii Sports. We're going to talk about our Wii days for a little bit, okay? I am ready. So. I've been very wanting to feel nostalgic about my childhood because we have, we've been focusing on 
our adulthood yeah. lately. Yeah. Yeah. I'm ready to dive in. Okay. I think we've talked about this a little bit before, about how you absolutely suck to play video games with. <laughs> I am, I am, I am, I'm not bad at video games. No, you're not bad clear. at video games. I'm not games. good at video games, but I'm not worse than Jade. Okay. Other no. than the fact that I am four years younger, and for some reason that gives her a leg up. I don't understand. I am just really good at everything. Okay? <laughs> I have anxiety. So you so have I am to be good. Amazing at everything. <laughs> like <laughs> there is no choice. Um, me and Alex literally had this conversation the other day. I am really good at a lot of things because I have to be in my brain. <laughs> like I'm like, well, yeah, I'm good at this. <laughs> like, <laughs> duh. Nice. Yeah, it's uh not good being a perfectionist. Anywho, we mostly played we played Wii Sports mm-hmm. a lot. We played like baseball, boxing. Yeah. There was a lot of bowling. There was a point know. in my life when I came home every night and boxed. Boxed, yep. With the Wii controllers. I got yep. sweaty. You know, yeah. boxing oh, yeah. boxing was the most labor intensive game oh yeah because you both arms yeah, yeah. Like and you've got to swing them uh-huh. you got to swing them and yep. you got to swing you got to get the right you know angles mm-hmm. and shit and you got to get the right timing yep. and when you go when you go down you have to shake the controller yep. like nothing else yes <laughs> <laughs> the shaking is just it's so ridiculous Oh yeah, no. That's uh, boxing is probably the most, the mo- one of the most addicting. Mm-hmm. You know, I think. Th- well, I think some of the other, the we other ones are just as addicting. Actually, See, I personally but, really loved baseball. But the the that's most labor intensive. Because I had all of the Twilight characters as me's, so I could play Correct. against all of them. Correct. Or they could all be on my team. Oh my god! Can <laughs> we talk about me's for a second? Yeah. We had our family. Yes, we made me's for like ourselves naturally. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Mom, she did not put her name in though. No, she named herself Belle. Yes, because her favorite Disney princess. Her favorite Disney princess. But yeah, then, but then I, I think I made, I made all of the Wolf's Rain characters. She did. You yeah. made all the Twilight characters. Yep. I, I would maybe have to look again. Mm-hmm. Um, we had some friends that made some too. Yes, yeah. Some friends that came mm-hmm. over and played the ones with that us. Were playing, yeah. Mm-hmm. And our our little cousin. Mm-hmm. She made a few. Yeah. And mm-hmm. she made them like w- with weird names mm-hmm. and weird weird shapes and faces. Like yeah. I don't know. She was like she they was were just random. She ones, was purposely yeah. trying to make them look as strange as possible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. But now you need to come over and make a person. Yeah. And you need to. <laughs> Because, like, we did that, and Alex's looks just like her. It's scary. Okay, that is scary. It's just because of is the it, settings that they more, have. It's more... No, it's literally... She it's took, not more detailed? Okay. It is more detailed. Oh, okay. They look like people. Oh. They don't look like me's. <sighs> Does it kind of look like some of the, like, people that they kind of draw? For, you know, the people, the people that are kind of in some of the ads and such? You think so? I don't know. I don't know. I don't in even know Switch what I'm sports to imagine. Ads, yes, it is those okay. people in the Switch Sports ads. <laughs> yeah. But, like, you get to choose your, like, whole outfit color. Mm-hmm. There's weird hair colors. There's lots of fun things. Yeah, so we had tons of people, and we were able to go, like, Charlie, where did he get so good at baseball? Yeah. <laughs> like, you gotta go, you gotta go, like, Hige, stop dropping the ball. <laughs> yeah, Hige, what the fuck? <laughs> um. <laughs> so, yeah, but... You were, you, like you said, you moved a lot when you were doing, like, the the boxing thing. Like, you were, like, uh-huh. it's intense. <laughs> you were, like, this is physically demanding and I am on it. I guess maybe that's why I But like do you want to know which game is not physically demanding that you made <laughs> physically demanding? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, not all Sadal of them. Dying. All Pretty of much, them. yes. I played, I played, I, pl- I played. Okay, so when you're playing on the Wii with the, um... Mario Kart. Oh, I thought you were talking about the With Mario Kart, you turn the controller. Mm -hmm. However, when you're playing on a DS, you do not. No. But I sure did (laughs) Uh, when I played on our cousin's DS. She went, "Uh, so I'm going around this corner. I am going to lean. Last night. That not last night. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, no. So this is when our grandparents DS. lived in a, a house that they moved out of like 
I was like eight years ago. Fifteen years ago, actually. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fifteen. Incorrect. Thirteen. Okay. Yes. Thirteen. Almost fifteen years. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was like, I was not five. I wouldn't have remembered. She was seven. <laughs> I was eight, I believe. Anyway, if, fuck. It was so long ago. I thought about that last time that we went over there, too, is that it was so long ago. Because it was sold to a family member. Uh, mm-hmm. It's still in the family. Yeah, we didn't just pop up and go, hey, we're just yes. going to walk through. Yeah, we didn't just go, <laughs> uh, I would like to visit my grandparents' old house. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Like Carrie Underwood in that one song. Wasn't that Miranda Lambert? No, I thought that was Carrie Underwood. The house that built me? Yeah, isn't that Carrie Underwood? Miranda Lambert. Are you kidding me? No, I'm pretty (laughs) sure it's Miranda Lambert. I'm looking this shit up. The house that built me. Miranda Lambert. (laughs) I guess. Yeah. Whatever. I, I don't know country music that well. Because she was with Blake Shelton when she wrote that. Mm. And now Blake Shelton is with Gwen Stefani. Wow. Last I said I don't I know the music, <laughs> so I know the people. Okay. No, uh, last time that I watched The Voice, which was a really long time ago. Okay. So they could have broken up. I don't know. Nice. So what was I saying about this? Oh, yeah, yeah. We went back there and... Yes, doesn't matter, because <laughs> I was talking about a time before that. I yes. chewed on my foot. I was a dog, and so you guys... That is just fucking you guys, disgusting. You, you guys shut me out of the room. You the were bedroom. chewing on your foot! I No, you guys shut me out first, and then I chewed on my foot. <laughs> and then you came out, and you're like, what are you doing? <laughs> Gotta clean out my pads. Oh my god. <laughs> Sidel, no. I know. No. Oh my god, we are moving back on to video games. What the fuck just happened? It's the same same day. You know, um, it's just what we is play, we play we used to play Super Mario Bros. Correct. On the Wii. We also came home every night and played Super Mario Bros. And turned on the radio. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We had the radio on, on the stereo. (laughs) Yeah. And then we had Super Mario Bros. going on the TV. Yeah. And we would sit and we would play. And we were so bad at it. (laughs) So, so bad. I don't think I've ever seen, like, (sighs) the sixth level. Okay. Except for that one time that our cousin like okay, yes. plowed through them. Mm-hmm. I don't remember what it what is. What are the levels? Okay, so it's it's one is the basic one, whatever mm-hmm. it is, and then two is the sand, and mm-hmm. then three is winter. Mm-hmm. What is four? Tropical, I think. Is it tropical? Mm-hmm. Okay, I believe you now. Like a water one. What is... Wait, what? Like a water one. The water... Tropical, okay. Yeah. There isn't just one where you're underwater most of the time. No. No, there's, there's a tropical. Okay, levels. there's a tropical one, and then there's like rainforest. Those are two different things. Oh, the tropical one. Yes, With the trees. The tropical one. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. And then is the rainforest one next? I think so. So that's a little five. Yeah, I the don't. The rainforest one is the one with the trees. The tropical one is the it's one where it's beachy. 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 Yes. There we go. <laughs> yes. And then I don't know. I have no idea what, what six and seven are. Nope. And then the eight is the, like, lava realm, but... Sure. Yeah. Yeah, the one that everything's on fire and I was screaming. Yeah. 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 I and that. there was one part that's, like, a roller coaster. <gasps> yeah, and it just keeps going super, super fast. And if you yeah. jump, like... I just spit at the microphone. I'm sorry. But if you jump, like, it goes without you and you're like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that shit was the worst. Oh, my God, Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god yeah <laughs> oh here's the thing though here's the thing though if we if you guys tell us that we should do this on patreon we'll make it we will make it we will try all the way through or we will make somebody else play or we will that die point. trying <laughs> i might i might actually kill you in real life if we have to do that <laughs> you know what actually we might have to like <laughs> play you know, like, I don't know. Anyway. 
You know, if you die so we many should just times, record- it resets your game, right? Like, it resets it to one. If you use so many, like, full lives, you know? Uh, yeah. If you go all the way down, like, I think it's, like, three times. Well, but if we're that good, we can make it. The thing is, it's practice, Jade. You don't mm. understand. Okay. What well, the thing is, though, uh, this was not a short topic, and... <laughs> <laughs> and we, um... Yeah, you're four bullets in, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> anyway, we're probably, we'll probably have to, like, I don't know, do, do a lot of editing in order to show you any of that. Because it would be uh, hours of gameplay hours. on the same level. Mm-hmm. Because we are not good. No. I Can I say my last bullet point, though? You're last? You're going to jump to the end? Well, I have... No, just go through the whole no, thing. I have one, two... Three, four. Oh, okay. Okay, if VR was a thing in 2010, <laughs> Sidel would have mastered every single game <laughs> because she was jumping. She was, like, diving. She was ducking. <laughs> she was, like, she'd lean the different directions that she needed to go. She'd, yeah. Like, everything. Every single move that she was trying to get her character to do, she would do. If she needed to shake the thing, she was jumping and, like, shaking. Like, she was jumping at the same time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm just saying, if we had I shake VR, when I need to jump as well. Yes. If we had VR in 2010 in our family living room, you would have Correct. been a master. You yes. Could, you would have gotten, like, all the way through. Mm-hmm. However, it was well, just the Wii. Sidel. It was just a Wii. Well, what else would I do? It's a controller in your hand. Where would I walk to? <laughs> You walk up to the fucking screen like it's gonna help you. <laughs> she stands in front of this fucker like, oh, if I get closer in this pixelated ass box TV, it's not gonna help. You can't see jack shit. The closer you get, the worse it gets. <laughs> I was being sucked in the game into the game like Jumanji. Okay, well, we I was only going had the to board become... game one out at that point, so. The board game Jumanji was the only movie Correct. that was out. Yeah, but you still get sucked into it. Yeah, but you can't That's get how it sucked works. into the, like, you can't video get game one before video it game. comes out. Yeah, you gotta wait. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Anyway, here's the thing. I'm really good at, I'm really good at my, be- my best thing. Tangents. In Super Mario Bros. Tangents. Is why are you why are you, you are really good at tangents me? yes well we have time okay anyway uh i think but i need to i need your to talk want to take us to dinner and it's almost seven Psh, your mom's not home oh she maybe is but anyway what are you good at in super mario the flying one that you get a power up that mm-hmm. you get on the first level mm-hmm. i'm amazing at that hat? yes yeah. because i that's all i do is shake Shakes. it yeah yeah I, I get up, I wander around, I, I, I it's very stressful <laughs> for me. <laughs> My body gets into it. I'm really glad you never got a DS, because I probably be would have climbing hit around someone. the house. You would have been <sighs> climbing around the house oh, for yeah. no fucking reason, trying to finish your game, you'd be like, <clears throat> and all over the house, and we would be like, what is happening? <sighs> And you would for sure hit someone. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What do you got for me? Well, maybe I would have gotten a calming game on my DS, like Dog Island. Or No, it's not Dog Island, but it's something like that. Dog something. Dog Island was on the Wii. <sighs> anyway, I... Have a new segment. Yay. That I'm it? wanting to add. I've named it Colloquialism Minute. Oh, okay. So you have 60 seconds. Let's go. <laughs> sure. Uh, so I wanted to talk about the phrase. This is. Yeah, no. No, yeah. Yeah, no, y- y- for sure. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no, for sure. Yeah, no, for sure. Yeah, no, for sure. Mm-hmm. 
there's this is a this is something that's like highly debated by people i feel like it, people go back and forth as to what what you really mean when you're saying it the kind mm-hmm. you know and everybody kind of has their own way of describing it i guess it's kind of you know mm-hmm. and 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 it's and i and i think that it's something that is not only present in the midwest but around the country so then the phrases are used a little bit different because they're in a different place mm-hmm. but anyway Typically, the answer to the mm-hmm. question, or what the first person said, is the second word. Yeah. And the first word is an acknowledgement mm-hmm. of the first person saying a statement. Yeah. Like what I'm doing right now. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know, and it kind of is like, um, like if, if, some, if you're talking to somebody and you say, yeah, no, like... You yeah, are... no, I don't do that usually. There you go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so you wanting you're wanting to add something mm-hmm. to the conversation. It's mm-hmm. it's usually it's typically it's like your not. Yeah, it's typically not the only thing that you say. It can be, but typically it's because you want you're wanting to say more. So if someone mm-hmm. were to ask me if me and my boyfriend were getting married, I would say. Yeah, no, we're both wanting to wait a while before we get married. <laughs> I would have said the same thing. <laughs> but you were wrong. Yes, um, <laughs> I was incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> if someone were to if someone were to suggest a kick-ass party idea mm-hmm. for a friend, I would say... No, yeah, that's a great idea. We should definitely get rent a litter of puppies for Sarah's birthday. I love that. <laughs> that is a beautiful idea. <sighs> and then if someone were to ask me if I wanted to make a Snickers salad for the potluck, yeah, I would know for sure. Yeah. Yeah, no, for I sure. Would say, yeah, no, for sure. Everyone loves Snickers salad. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Snickers salad's fucking delicious yeah mm-hmm. so yeah no means no mm-hmm. no yeah means yeah mm-hmm. uh and yeah no for sure means definitely yes <laughs> although widely understood throughout the midwest and america it is not widely understood in other countries yeah this phrasing mm-hmm. so while getting food at jade's university Mm-hmm. In Germany. Mm-hmm. The lunch lady asked if I was a student. Mm-hmm. And Jade said, yeah, no. And <laughs> she said, which is it? <laughs> yes. Oh, no. <laughs> because you said both. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because I, uh, I say yeah a lot. Yeah. If you haven't realized, mm-hmm. that is, like, one of the only interjections that I use. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. And then we move on. Yep. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, no, she's not. Like, if it, if I'm not <laughs> listening, and then I'm brought back in. Yeah. Yeah, usually comes out of my mouth. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, because it's just, yeah, you said something to me, and now I'm going to answer. Yeah. <laughs> and no, there's no need for you to continue explaining. The answer is yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's it for our colloquialism minute. Was that it? Yeah. Okay, that was quick. Yeah, I told you. It's one thing. I like it. So we can do this again. Yeah, no, no, no. Having yeah. just one one word or phrase. Yeah, no. And we just no, talk about you. it. It's a short one. Yeah, no, thank you. <laughs> you don't um, want to do it? My favorite is actually, yeah, no, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, no, for sure. <laughs> I used to say that a lot. Yeah. I'm like, oh, yeah, no, for sure. Uh-huh. Also, I'll add the, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, for sure. Oh, yeah. No. Oh, yeah, no, Oh, for yeah, sure. no, for sure. Yep. <laughs> Yep. I also like that you've been saying I that with an accent this whole time. Asked, yes. I asked your father mm-hmm. if it's because I wasn't quite sure. Mm-hmm. If it was yeah, no, for sure, or mm-hmm. no, yeah, for sure. Because oh, I feel yeah, like no, I sure. kind of use them interchangeably. 
No, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I just had to say it. Like, but he way. said, I don't know, that sounds like something a Minnesotan would say. <laughs> so you went, mother. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she was at work, so I didn't ask. Oh. I sent it to you, but then I was just like, you know what, I'm just going to look it up. Because I found some, like, videos of people also talking about this. Yeah. And they used the phrase, yeah, no, for sure. Mm-hmm. Not no, yeah, for sure. So I was like, I'll go with that one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because they mean the same thing to me. Well, okay, so if you think about it this way, yeah, no, mm-hmm. it's the last word. Yes. But so you're saying you for did sure. no, yeah, for sure, it'd yeah. be negative, positive, positive. And we don't like that. We want a sandwich. Yes, it's so true. So we want a positive, negative, positive sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The other ones, they're okay being open-faced sandwiches. Uh-huh. It's fine. We're... We're okay with having one slice of bread and then all of our toppings. You know, cheese on your bread. Yeah. But we really prefer the, like... You can't have two slices of yeah, bread no, for with sure. the cheese on top. Yeah, no, for sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's not... No. Mm-hmm. Or, like, two slices of cheese with bread on top. That's not okay. <laughs> 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 oh, that's worse. That reminds me of Lightyear. Have you seen it? No, I've not. Oh, you guys need to let me be a Disney adult and please go watch that. <laughs> I love it. I've been trying to catch up on like tons of other stuff. I'm on shows. I decided to watch the Marvel Netflix shows that are now on Disney Plus, mm-hmm. and that was a big venture. Yeah. Uh, and I'm like halfway through probably. Uh, and um, now I'm behind on the uh ones that are coming out now yeah the new shows yeah like and She-Hulk. like they are yeah mm-hmm. and miss miss marvel yeah mm-hmm. yeah and then i i have to I, I i'm gonna have to go back to friends at some point but only murders in the building is coming out yes the season, they yeah. start no they start it's already like out the whole season's out maybe not there might be some more episodes that they're still releasing but it's like I halfway out like at least month. i forget about it for a month and then i go oh <gasps> There's more episodes, and then I binge them, <laughs> oh, and then okay. I forget about it again for a month. <laughs> yeah, I think there's at least eight. I don't know. There's oh, okay. a few. So they're probably coming to the end of their yeah second season. Yeah. So I figured uh, it's probably about time to start. Yeah. So I can finish. Dad uh started watching it and then stopped. So <laughs> I'm gonna screw up his uh Hulu. You know, he's not gonna know where he is, but he probably has to start. There's another the account anyway. on there. What is it? I don't understand whose account it is, though. You're who's... watching your dad's. Yeah. There are four accounts on there. There's Two. one for me. No. There's one for me. When I go on Hulu, it's 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 dad and the greatest person in the Loveliest world. Loveliest person Loveliest in the world. Loveliest person in the world. If you go up, there are two more people. What? Yes. If you go <laughs> who? up. Me. Uh-huh. And then Golden Girls. Golden Girls hasn't been used in, like, four years. Who are these people? Who is the loveliest person in the world and who is Golden Girls? Alex is the loveliest person ever. Okay. See, that's the thing. I was more then, comfortable with using dads than the loveliest person ever. Well, don't use that one. That one's Alex's. Okay. Uh, use Golden Girls. Okay. And you can rename it if you'd like. All right. But Golden Girls was the one in my college dorm that we had on the TV that was in the living room. Okay. Sure. Yes. Use that one. You can literally scroll up. You didn't know that? No, I thought Dad's was on top. No, whenever we watch Hulu at, like, our apartment, if we watch it in the TV in the living room, it's at loveliest person ever. If we watch it in the TV in our bedroom, it's at mine. I hate that it looks like that. I that know. it scrolls. I know. And it gets rid- hides Hulu? everything else. Hulu? Are you listening? <laughs> are, are you listening, Are you Hulu? listening? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, now that we've uh, <clears throat> fought Hulu, and while well, I just said that I'm living and a big the TV, nerd. and <laughs> and we have no yad for sure. Uh, uh, yeah. yeah, no for sure. Yeah, we know, yeah, no for sure. Yeah. All right. It is time to say our goodbyes. This has been cheese a healthy fruit. Bye forever. Oh. <laughs> I once said my fa- my forehead looked like Wi-Fi, so goodbye forever. <laughs> God. <laughs> Vines. <laughs> Bye. See you next time. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye-bye now. Bye-bye.
Thanks for listening to Cheese, a Healthy Fruit. Our cover art is by MJ Hennessy. Our theme song is by Melina Marchese. You can find her at melinamarchese.com. Follow the podcast on Instagram at cheese underscore a healthy fruit, Jade at Jade Powers with an extra S, and Sidel at Sidel Powers, spelled C-Y-D-E-L. If you have any questions or want to submit a story from your childhood, email us at cheeseahealthyfruit at gmail.com. Sources can be found in the show notes. You can find Cheese, a Healthy Fruit, wherever you get your podcasts and on YouTube. Subscribe to Cheese, a Healthy Fruit and leave us a five-star review on your favorite podcasting app. See you next time. Bye-bye.